Hi, it's Laurie here from Morrison Watson. I've got a couple of tips for you uh, regarding putting text around rings. So one of the first things that we like to look for are dimensions that are going to work well. Now this dimension here is going to be much, much too small. It won't work. So we're at 0.17 of a millimeter. That's just way too small. The printer won't want to print it and it won't cast well. You'd be far better off aiming for something a little wider. So the widths that we have here are 0.7. That would work perfectly well. You could even reduce this down a little if the text is too long to go and fit in the area that you want it to. You can squash that down and 0.38. That would still work perfectly well. So once you've got your text right and the size is right, then flow it around the ring. Extract those surfaces out and the other thing to watch for are the depths that you extract those surfaces to. If we look at this, we've come down here 0.5 of a millimeter. Any more than that, and you start ending up with tall sections of plaster that are not very stable. So imagine this red section here being plaster and everything else is hollow. The metal's coming in, it's crashing into things. So keep it short, keep it 0.5 of a mil, that'll work really, really nicely. And then of course once you've got all that done, do your Boolean difference, and then we have our text around the ring. That should print, and it should cast perfectly well. Thanks for watching.